And I'm Brad Johansson. A new weapon in the heroin epidemic is brick and mortar. It's a building in the West End. The Center for Addiction Treatment, or the Cat House as it's called, just finished a new addition that will help treat nearly three times more patients. Local 12's Megan Mongello is live tonight with a look at the services that will be added. Megan. Well, Paula and Brad, the Cat House has been around since 1970, and this is the first major expansion project for those battling addiction. What you see behind me could help save their life. Behind the wire fence, you can see the men and women who right now are fighting to get off drugs. The barrier will come down soon, and this brand new courtyard will be a place of solace for them. The walking path has monuments for the 12 steps to recovery. I couldn't live, and I couldn't die, and I couldn't stand wanting to live in the misery. Christina Locke is four years sober. We talked to her inside the brand new $5 million Spalding Recovery and Family Care Building. Two, three, yeah! There was a ceremonial ribbon cutting. With the celebration over, it's now time for the tough work to begin. Patients will get help like never before. So we decided we wanted to do something totally new, if you will, and integrate both the physical health, mental health, which is also new for us, as well as the addiction medicine piece. So a patient coming in can get all of their needs met in one location. Sandy Keene has been the CEO for 26 years. She showed off the new medical clinic that will be staffed with doctors certified in addiction treatment. They specialize. They understand addiction, but they also understand the, all of the physical health issues that are within the realm of primary care. There's also a medication assisted treatment clinic and a counseling center for mental health services. It's not just for patients, it's for their families as well. I absolutely wish that there would have been some family counseling so that I could um, re reconnect with my family faster than I did because I had actually pushed my family so far away that they didn't want anything to do with me. By adding all the new services, this addition was built to make a difference. It's expected that 3,500 patients each year will be helped through the new addition here at the Cat House. And that is a number that the staff here says will make an impact on the opioid addiction in our region. Reporting live in the West End, Megan Mangello, Local 12 News. All right, good to hear something positive on that. Thank you, Megan. 26 new staff members are being hired to help handle all of the new patients.